Hello everyone, this is Good Dr. Dan with Packrath TCG, and we are going to be entering parts four slash five. I managed to pick up two more of these. I'm gonna to try to open up these nice and quickly for everybody. Let's get this box open. Try to open up both at the same time. Got a nice big stack of packs. As I said in the last few installments of these videos, this is a Japanese exclusive version of Hidden Fates and Shining Fates, which are the English versions. And there are a bunch of exclusive Japanese ver versions of cards in here. You can pick these up for between $90 and $100, $110 US. You can also pick them up sometimes cheaper in from Japan, but shipping will be higher. And we are on the hunt for a full art alternate version of Marnie in her gym uniform. Again, the price is between $300 and $400. That's our chase card. That's what we're really hunting for. That's what we really, really want. Starting off with a Pokemon trap. A, a Pinquil. A cup of tea. Prism Energy. A bigger cup of tea. A, f a shiny Frost Moth. An Orangutan. A Coughing. And a V of that legendary dog. Zashian? Is that it? Z and Z Zamazetta? Is that the other one? Zashian and Zamazetta? That sounds right. Okay. That's a Pokemon. That's a Rowlet. That is another Pokemon. Rusted Shield. That's a Fossil. A shiny Weezing Alo uh, Alolan? No. Galarian. I think that's Boss's Orders. I can't speak Japanese. I just think it's Boss's Orders. A Frost Moth and a Cramorant V. It's in the last couple of videos. Each pack has a V or better in every single pack. So you can get V, V Max, Shinies, all kinds of different things in these packs. Never got that Pokemon yet. Sobble, Bonnelby, Ball Guy, Orbital, uh, Fire Energy, uh, Dart, Dartrix, something like that. A Evolve Form of Corsola, an Eldegoss V, and a Willow. So far, we got two shinies right off the bat. Quite a few packs to go in this video. Here we go. Choodle, Applin, Dreadnought, Psychic Energy, Evolve Form of Grookey, Zamazetta, that is a Pokemon, a VMAX Toxtricity, in somebody's house in foil. We got our first VMAX. Very, very nice. I'll miss that a little bit. My surgical precision is waning. Love these packs. Seriously, seriously love these packs. They're very, very fun to open. You always get something spicy. Let's see. Heatron. Boltund. VMAX Crobat. And a little shiny Trubbish. Actually, not shiny. Foily. My apologies. Not a shiny, it is a foily. It's these special circle foils that you get in these packs, which is exclusive to Japanese cards so far as I know. Indeedy. That is a Pokemon. That is a Water Pail. Uh, Linoon. Uh, that's a big one. That is a Pokemon. That's an Indeedy V and Ch Chin. Chin Chow? No. Big version of Chin Chow. Chin Chow's older cousin. Oops, I, have, I have the wrong stack over here. There we go. That's a Milsery, Gossiflor, Feebas. That's a Potion, a Corviknight, a Double Normal Energy, a Copperaja, a that's a Pie, and that is a V Max Gorilla. <laughs> awesome, V Max Gorilla. There we go. these cards out of here. Score Bunny. That's Rowlet's of, uh, that's Dust Tricks, Dark Tricks, something like that. Phalanx. Score Bunny's Evolved Form. Electric Energy. A shiny, I think this is a Chin Chow. Shiny Chin Chow, I think. Uh, Tapi Coco. Clefairy. A v Eternius V and a Rainbow Foily. I think it's like a multi-energy, something like that. I don't speak Japanese. I don't read Japanese either, but it looks like a multi-energy of some variety. 
uh, Galarian Meowth, Sizzlypede, Krogunk, Mr. Rhyme, an Octopus, a Fishing Pole, a Cinderace, and there we go. Wow, we got a Gold Eternius VMAX. That's amazing. We got one of the gold rares. So now this is one of the exclusive cards to this set, I think. Is one of the VMAX uh, gold cards. And our last card is a Toxtricity V. This goes up here. I'm really glad we got one of the gold cards so I was able to show that off. So as people could see that. It is one of the cards you can get. And I think there's a couple variations of those uh, gold rares you can get. Of each of the legendaries from Sword and Shield, I'm pretty sure. I think you can get Eternius V, VMAX, Zashian, and Zamazetta. Zama, Zamazetta? I think that's what that is. Cramorant. Team Yeltel. A Sawana. I think it's a Zashian. That is a spiky boy. And that is a shiny V, Gorilla Boom. There we go. So we're on four shinies in that, plus our gold rare. Now we're going to go into our second box, which we already have opened right over here. Wait, it's a nice big stack. Coughing. Toxel. Clefairy. Dark Energy. A Pokemon. Bucket of Water. A Heatran. Copperaja. And a Cinescorch V. I've been trying to make these videos a little bit shorter, a little bit sweeter, so people have a easier time digesting them. I know I have a tendency to ramble. I'm trying to get better at that. I'm trying to get better for everybody here so you all can enjoy my content just a little bit better and enjoy Pack Rats TCG a little bit better. I'm trying to keep my mouth shut a little bit more so we can focus on the cards. Rillaboom V. As I'm talking through all the cards and not seeing what they are. But that's neither here nor there. Not too many hot topics right now, not for Pokemon anyway, other than the price is skyrocketing for everything, and I just like opening them, so I can't help it. So that's a Cobra. Weezing, an Ice Cube, another Big Goblin Boy Shiny V. Okay, a lot of Shiny Vs. I believe the pull rate of the full art Marnie alternate and the Charizard are about the same. It's like one in 400 packs. It's very, very rare. Very, very rare. But hey, you never know what we can pull. You never, never know. That's a Pokemon. Buy that's a boss of orders. And as a VMAX Centiscorch and a Phoebus. A feeble Phoebass. Well, it does evolve into Milotic, which is actually a very, very good Pokemon. Not just in the games, but also in the card game. Milo takes a pretty good Pokemon. That's an Ugly Duckling. More Peko. A Cobra. A, a, a Greedent. Rose. That's a Barracuda. Uh, that's a Pokemon. That's also a Pokemon. And that's a Phalanx V. And a little foily potion at the end there. A couple of packs left. This is our fifth out of the... We got four more. A Choodle. An Applin. Zigzagoon, Prism Energy, that's a Teeth Hot, uh, Shiny Indeedy, Perserker, an Orangutan, and an Indeedy V. So we got two Indeedies in that pack. Very, very nice. I almost forgot to mention, if you are interested in pricing out your Japanese cards, one of the most reliable sources that I've found for English pricing of Japanese cards would be Toad and Troll. Uh, I've been using it a little bit, and the prices seem to be more accurate based off of current market value. You got a Marnie, you got an amazing rare Kyogre, and a Zamazetta V. Very, very nice. So we got three more packs. Yeah, Toad and Troll for your pricing to see if you can get the most accurate ver uh, pricing for Japanese cards in the English amount. Because sometimes uh, Japanese cards are cheaper in Japan with Japanese currency. Got a shiny Galarian Meowth. Love that. A Frostmoth. A Flapple. And a Crobat V. A lot of Crobats. A lot of Toxtricities. A lot of Dracapults. I know Tox uh, Dracapult and Crobat have their own product. So... 
uh, for that, I should say, for Shining Fates. That's a Grookey. Corvus Squire. More Peko. A lot of different arts on more Peko. A Dreadnought. Psych Energy. A Thwacky. A Toxtricity. Zamazetta. And a Rillaboom VMAX. Very, very nice. This is our last, last pack for the absolute spiciness. Last pack. Let's see what we can pull. I'm going to keep my eyes closed. I'm going to try to count to... I'm going to count to eight. So, one, uh, two, three, four, five, six, uh, seven, eight, nine, ten. What do we get? Oh. Oh, we got a shiny. Okay. I didn't even know. Awesome. We got a shiny dub wool. Uh, that is a Clefable. Clefairy. Clefable. And a apple pie. A big old ditto. And a dreadnought. So that is the last of what I have for shiny star V. Hopefully I will be able to get more of this product in the future. I love opening this product. There's lots of chances for a lot of really good cards. And let's take a look at what we got through these two boxes. A lot of lovely shinies here. Looks like we average about three per box. There's our shiny. Shiny. Yeah, we average about four per box, almost exactly. I think we might have got five in an earlier video, though. I love the foiling on these cards. It's very, very bright in comparison to the English variations of, this, of these. And our best card that we pulled out of the set so far, the I think it's the Eternius VMAX, the Golden Rare. Awesome. Thank you very much for sticking with me for the whole video. I'll see you next time. Stay safe out there. Peace.